everybody, it's me again, and I am here with a June Favorites video. Um, but before I start with my June Favorites, I just wanted to make a quick little announcement that I'm super excited about. Okay, so, uh, I won't go into detail because I know it's kind of boring, but I'm doing wedding, wedding? I'm doing wedding? I'm doing makeup at a wedding. I'm so excited. Um, it's for my manager and she's going to be a bridesmaid in the wedding. And the wedding is like a coworker of mine, um, her wedding, and like I, I work today and this is what I wear to work, yay, so cute, I did my hair. Um, but anyway, my manager was talking about, oh I really like your makeup today, your eyelashes, this and that, what are they? I'm about to have you run to Sephora and get me some eyelashes for tomorrow. And I was like, well don't, don't get makeup forever eyelashes because they're expensive, you know, and we're just talking stuff. And so we finally got to talking, so we decided that I'm going to do her makeup tomorrow. I'm very excited. And I didn't think she was going to pay me, but she was like, oh, I'll pay you even. How's $25? And I was like, really? Like, I was shocked. I was just thinking, you know, you don't have to. But, yeah, I was, I was very excited. I just wanted to do it so that I could take some pictures for my portfolio because I don't have a portfolio, and I wanted to start making one so I can do events and, you know, stuff. So I'm very excited about that. Um... And apparently, so there's four bridesmaids, including her and one bride. And there's no makeup artist, but there is a hairstylist. So I'm doing my manager's makeup for sure. And I might end up doing other girls' makeup, which is like, woo! Because I wasn't expecting it at all. The only bad thing is I don't have any foundation or anything. I have my foundation, but I don't have anyone else's. So I told her, I was like, tell everyone to bring their foundation. Um, so yeah, I'm very, very excited. I'm very, very nervous though. I have no idea what to expect. Um, my friend was supposed to come and help me. Her name is, oh, you know, you just saw the video, Marissa. She was supposed to come, but, um, she canceled because she has stuff to do. Um, but anyway, uh, I think I'm gonna have Percy come and help me because, shockingly, he knows more about makeup than the average girl, which is crazy. Well, he's, he's very good. He, he pays attention. But yeah, so I'm probably going to have him come help me, which I hope is okay. I'll probably call Amanda beforehand and be like, is it okay? Uh, so yeah, um, what else? Oh, yeah, hopefully I can fit it all into this box. This is just a small caboodle box. It looks bigger on camera than it really is. It's actually quite small. See? And it's only got a few compartments. I'll show you guys really quick. See, it's one of these. But it should be okay. That and maybe one or two other bags I can put some stuff in. It should be fine. So yeah, I'm going to do that. Right after I finish this video, I'm actually going to get all of my makeup, literally every single thing, because I don't know what they're going to want. I'm going to get that and put it all in there. And I'm going to make it work. Um, so yeah, I'm very excited. Because the thing is, I'm not a pro or anything, as you guys know. I mean, I'm, I'm just you know, a beauty junkie, and I make videos in my room in front of my bed, which is kind of messy right now. Um, you know, I never thought I would get into makeup artistry or anything. You know, I, I've always wanted to, but never had the opportunity. So, it's not like I'm going to be a makeup artist now, but I'm very excited because this is my first gig. Can I say gig? Well, I can control if I say gig. But yeah, it's my first gig. I'm so excited! So yeah, anyway, now that I got that out of the way, let me just go ahead and show you guys my favorites really quick. It won't take long, I promise, because there's not many. Um, but yeah, so the first one is this. This is my Domo Kun. I don't know, they just call him Domo here? I think they just call him Domo in America. Um, but, sorry I keep saying um, I don't mean to. Anyway. So I went to the movies with my brother and my boyfriend, and my brother tried to win Domo from the vending machine, and it was 50 cents supply. He tried once or twice, I don't remember, and he didn't get them. And then Bruce is like, mm, let me try. So he tries, and he wins him on the first try. Very exciting. I love him, even though he's kind of funky shaped and his teeth are all jacked up, I still love him. He was technically like a dollar or a dollar fifty, but totally worth it. So cute. So, that's my non-makeup related item. I don't really do that, but I, I don't know, I like Domo. So yeah, there's that. Of course, I like my make make it make it palette. I cannot talk. And then uh, I've been trying out this primer here. I think it's pretty good. 
not super amazing, but pretty good. This is the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. Oh, sorry. I'm like getting out of focus. I hope you guys can see me. Yeah, I guess so. But yeah, this is the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer, the regular one, or original, oil-free. And I have not touched up, and it's been like eight hours. So I'd say it does pretty good. I'm pretty, I'm a little bit, a little bit oily, but not too much. It's, it's good. So yeah, there's that. Um, as you guys know, I always like my eyeliner. This is the Physicians ooh, Formula 2-in-1 Eye Booster. And I like this. It's still good. It kind of is starting to dry out on me again, so, yeah, but I still like it. But it has been like two months, I think. Um, I've been really reaching for this primer. This is the L'Oreal Hip Cream Shadow Paint in number 807 Secretive. I like this a lot. Uh, I'm wearing it today. And you probably see it in the video I did with Marissa. I did her makeup and I used this to prime. So there's that. Um, I love, love, love my Benetint. I'm using it. I'm wearing it on my lips right now with a juicy tube. But I absolutely love it for cheeks and lips. When I'm not wearing any makeup at all during on whatever day that I'm not wearing makeup, I'll always use it on my cheeks. I'll just do like a tiny bit of eyeliner right on the outer corner and then Benetton. That's like all I wear. I love it. So there's that. And then last thing I wanted to show you guys my nails. Ooh, it looks neon. Ooh. But anyway, um, I had acrylic nails because I really was sick of my nails. Like I was painting them, um, and then they would always peel. Like literally, the surface of my nail would peel. And I really didn't like that. I don't know. I was just sick of it. And it was frustrating because it had been like that for like two months. And it just got worse and worse each time I wanted to paint my nails. So I got acrylic nails, which is not good for your nails at all. But I just was so sick of it. And I wanted to see my nails being pretty because I was sick of them. And I, yeah, and then I got them done. Then I didn't like them anymore. So I filed them down and painted them. Here he is. This will work for now because it, it provides a barrier for my nails. I have super, super, super weak nails, the weakest nails ever, so this is good. They look horrible up close, so I'm not going to show you, <laughs> but uh, yeah, here you can see them from far away. But the nail polish that I'm going to feature in my favorites for this month is this one. This is Essie's Clam Bake. It's red-orange, if you can't tell, and it looks really neon in this, in, in my viewfinder. Uh, I bet it's not in, when I put up the video, it won't look neon. But um, the reason that I got this was because I follow um, Extra Petite. She's a fashion blogger, a petite blogger. And she has this nail polish on pretty much all the time. And I'm always looking at it, looking at her posts and her nails. And I'm just like, oh my god, I want that, I want that, I want that. And I tried to figure out what she was wearing, but I had no idea. And finally, I found out that she had this color on. I knew it was Essie, but I didn't know what. So yeah, she finally posted it, um, or mentioned it in one of her posts, and I was like, oh my god, you finally! So I went and got it, like, right away. So yeah, I really love this color. I'm probably going to wear it all the time, and I have it on my toes. I have, like, retarded-looking feet. But oh well. Anyway. Um, yeah. And then, um, I wanted to show you guys my makeup, too, while I'm at it, really quick, before I forget. I won't go into detail about what I'm wearing. But if you do like it, let me know and I can make a tutorial. It's super, super simple. I mean, it's kind of, yeah, straightforward. So yeah, my brows are done. Well, not done, but I filled them in and gelled them and all that good stuff. So they're in place. And, oh, you can see my nails. <laughs> um, but anyway, so this is what my eyes look like today. And, oh, I, I put the primer on my lower lid area and it still creases. So I'm kind of unhappy about that. But, I mean, I'm sure it'll always be like that. But anyway, I'm wearing lashes also. And I've got this little peak of, I mean, not peak. Um, what is it called? Little hint, I guess, of blue right on the outer corner. Because I didn't want to put it all on the lower lash line because I think that's kind of overdone. And I wanted to do something different. So I did this. Uh, so let me know if you like it and I can do a tutorial or whatever. So, yeah. Um get my hair back down so yeah that's all for my June favorites and all that I wanted to talk to you about sorry I took so long in talking I talk a lot but anyway I hope y'all have a great 
July, and I hope you had a great June. And if you have any questions, like always, let me know. Um, and if you have any requests or whatever, requests, I know it doesn't sound like I said anything, but I said requests. But yeah, if you have any requests, let me know. And ooh, I think that's it. And I'm sorry Angel isn't here making an appearance. Uh, I don't know where she is. She's probably like go begging for food somewhere. <laughs> I think my brother's eating dinner. Uh, even though it's 10.26 p.m. Oh, you can see my doggie. He's so cute. But yeah, oh, here. Here's an appearance by her. Hee <laughs> hee. She's so cute. I love her. But yeah. Okay, I'm done. Oh yeah, and for my hair, just in case you're wondering, gosh, I, I just keep thinking of things to say. I curled it um, with the, my curling wand that you guys have seen, and it was just like, whew, so curly. And I was just like, you know what, this is too formal. I look like I'm going to somewhere fancy. So I just um, put it in this high ponytail, and I didn't spray it with anything. Oh, I used the, um, the macadamia oil again, but I didn't use any hairspray. I just let it go so it could kind of fall like this, and I like it. Um, anyway, side ponytail and used a cute hair tie with a star on it. So, that's all. And it did this on involuntarily. I didn't put this piece here, but it looks kind of nice, I guess. But yeah, um, and I'm dressed very 4th of July. I don't know why I did that. I just wanted to wear my new shirt and then thought it looked good nautical style. So, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> I'm weird. But I miss you guys and I will see you in the next video and yeah I'll talk to you later